Dr. Joe here to talk a little bit about prevention of type 1 diabetes. Uh, this was forwarded to me, uh, but it's not a brand new thing. It's something uh, from 2009 and November 9th issue of, uh, of uh, the journal Pediatrics, Advanced uh, Pediatrics. And what they found is that there was a dramatically low amount of vitamin D in the blood of uh, patients who are newly diagnosed with uh, vitamin D deficiency and newly diagnosed with a situation where they had type 1 diabetes. The second aspect of this was that uh, there were a lot of people in that area that were deficient, but those who had type 1 diabetes were very low, almost unmeasurably low levels of vitamin D, whereas those deficient and having other health problems were actually uh, 20 to 30 percent higher than that. So it appears that the association of low vitamin D, really at the very lowest levels, may play a role in type 1 diabetes.